Fishing is a great way to spend time with your children. Many parents out there, like us, are raising children on the spectrum. Despite its challenges, fishing is still a wonderful way for your kids to try something new. Here are five tips to fishing with children on the spectrum. Start with what you know. The spectrum is just that, a wide array of differences in intellect, social abilities, and sensory needs. As a parent, you will know best whether fishing and the outdoors are a good fit for your child. If they do have an interest in the outdoors, think about what types of areas they feel most comfortable in, whether that's shoreside in an urban setting, a rural setting, or possibly on the water. Remember, teamwork can make things easier. Raising and caring for a kid is a lot. Kids ask a lot of questions and have many needs. Whether your child is neurodivergent or neurotypical, it helps to have some adult backup on the excursions. Be sure to take your time. Fishing doesn't need to be stressful. Remember that it's about enjoying the experience and not racing for a trophy. If things start to get frustrating, taking breaks is a part of the experience. Consider sensitivities. Some kids on the spectrum have sensitivities to flickering light, like that caused by water ripples or certain sounds and sensations. It's a good idea to bring a good pair of sunglasses, as well as things like earplugs and gloves for holding rods and touching water or bait. You might also want to bring along a soothing object or toy to help if they get a bit overstimulated. Celebrate positive time together and enjoy the non-fishing aspects of the excursion. Mitigate fixation on a specific fish catching goal by ensuring that part of the day is related to something else. You can focus on spotting different types of birds near the water, documenting plant species or insects, or just having a positive experience outdoors. Everyone, kids and adults alike, experience things differently. That's why it's important to get out and create a wide array of memories, no matter where you land on the spectrum of life. Get out there and enjoy the outdoors. Like and subscribe and tell us how you and your kids like to enjoy nature in the comments.